Uh, just back from the winter in Australia. Atmosphere must be buzzing with the World Cup, right? Yeah, obviously I'm not there for it at the moment, but it was um, before I left. And you know, I think the Big Bash set the standard for the atmosphere in Australian cricket this summer. It was on every night for sort of six weeks. So uh, cricket became a massive focus point for all Australians. And I think mean, we've just been watching it there in the changing room and to see them get through to the final um, is a great achievement. And I think they'll have a little bit too much for the Kiwis. Yeah. Obviously, we've got a couple of members of staff who are Australian, a couple of New Zealand, a bit of banter in the dressing room with the guys, especially some of the lads that play with England. Yeah, I've only, you know, I've only got the Aussie accent really on the palm, but um, you know, I'll be cheering on the Aussies come. I think it's Saturday here, so yeah. um, you know, it'd be a great achievement for the for them to win it. Yeah. Um, New Zealand have all the form going into the final. They've played, you know, outstanding cricket before that last, uh, the last sort of series, and. You know they've they've got some players in form, and you know I think the Aussies are just a little bit too strong. They've got too many match winners down that batting lineup. And we've got the World Champions potentially coming here in in June. How how's that going to be to to play against those yeah, if you, you know, get selected? It, it's very exciting, obviously for for everyone involved, um, the club, the players, the guys that are going to play in the game. Um, it's not something you get to do. And for some people, they won't get to play against them players throughout their careers. So, you know, to have them coming here for the area is very exciting. Um, you know, and knowing most of them that I do, I know they're looking forward to it. And, you know, it's going to be a massive summer for them. Um, English cricket, Australian cricket and everything. So, yeah, yeah it should be good. And how's pre-season gone so far? Yeah, it's been very good. Um, you know, we seem to be getting sort of uh, on and off days where we can get outside and have a good sort of five hours training. And days like today where we're indoors and it's a little bit frustrating because indoors there's not a lot you can do, especially the bowlers with it being such a hard surface. So, you know, you do all your gym work inside and then... You know, you have your bat and, and your day's sort of done. But, um, you know, we're quite lucky because the, the time I spent up north, north of Durham, those times there, we had one outdoor training session before the first game. Right. But um, here, you know, the ground staff do a great job and, and we've already had sort of three outdoor sessions in the first week. So, you know, it's very good and the lads are keen and looking forward to it.